Mark Walton, the tailback for Miami. Flags are down. Rozier's going to take a shot down the field for Richards. I believe he made that catch. Looks like he got the foot inbounds. Let's see if this play is going to hold up or not. Dave, this is a perfect throw and catch. Rozier is putting it on the money. And uh, here's a guy that hadn't played very much coming off of the injury. And you start looking at Richards. He got the ball, was put in the perfect place, but his feet were perfectly inbounds for the catch. Rozier. Except for Mark Walt, who's in there once again at running back. Blitz coming. Rozier hit as he throws. Richards makes another catch near the sideline. And I'm on Richards showing that he is indeed over that hamstring injury. They needed him for energy, speed, and just his ability. Man coverage outside again. He has a little double move. He stops like he's going to hitch. He goes down the boundary, keeps some space outside. Impressed with Rozier. What a combination these two guys have been tonight. Washington State to follow us. Rozier over the middle. Miami's got some room here. 20, 15. Richards, he's back in. Touchdown, Miami. Richards didn't look as fast as he could be. Didn't have to be. Miami, 23 to 3. Mac. During the break, we were wondering what happened to Richards. We didn't see him in the third quarter. Here he is. Well, we got it answered. It's an under route, and it's a bust by the Duke defense. He comes on a shallow underneath route, outruns everybody. He still looks like he's a little tight there, possibly, because he's the young man we talked about earlier that's fighting the hamstring. That formation with the backup center, Gaynor at fullback, and Rozier will step back and throw. He'll go one-on-one. -on -one. Richards fights it off. There's a flag down, and it might be offensive pass interference here. Let's see. Richards is not exactly overjoyed with that touchdown catch. I think he knows he got caught. Pass interference, number 82. 15-yard penalty from the previous spot. Fourth down. And now it's fourth down and very long. Well, and I've got no problem with Mark throwing deep with this lead. Because you're sitting here with a young receiver that's a sophomore that hadn't played much. You got a young quarterback. You're working on the rest of your year. Coverage again, great by Gilbert. So impressed with Gilbert. 